Hi buddies, welcome back, it's Anne Sophie and today I have the new Motorola Edge 40. This is it from the back. It has a really nice chic design. This is the camera. It feels a bit like leather. I doubt that it is leather really, but um, it feels a bit like it. It has like a nice touch to it. So now we go ahead and set it up together and we'll go through the first steps. So we get welcomed here and then we can select our language and then we can get started. It wants us to connect to a mobile network. We're not gonna do that because we have a separate video for that. So we say skip. Then we want to connect to Wi-Fi. We want to do that for sure to use like the Play Store and YouTube and whatever else connecting and now the next step is getting our phone ready privacy and software updates Motorola collects and reports usage information to keep your software up to date provide personalized support and improve products and services data collected will be transferred to Motorola service in the USA you can change your privacy preferences anytime by going to settings privacy Motorola privacy so you can enable and disable these as you like and then accept and continue looking for updates copy apps and data you can choose to transfer your apps photos contacts google accounts and more if you click on next the phone will go with you through the next steps we say don't copy sometimes it's nice to just start fresh again also i don't have a device that i'd like to copy well apps and data from checking info and now we can sign into our google account use well the play store stuff if you don't have a google account you can create one there i'm gonna put in my email address and then we come to the next slide we publish the google terms of service so that you know what to expect as you use our services by clicking i agree you agree to these terms you can also read through the google play terms of service and the privacy policy and then i agree or the other possibility would be to just not add the account then we have google services use basic device backup use location allow scanning send usage and diagnostic data install updates and apps use location keep in mind that the allow scanning can only be on if the use location is on otherwise that it doesn't work um and then you can read through it, get more information and then go to accept. Now you can choose your search engine. If you click on the little arrows here, you have more information about each search engine. Um, because yeah, for example, plant trees and protect your privacy as you search. Right, we'll go with that for now and go to the next step. Set a pin, we're not gonna do that now. We have a separate video for that as well so we will skip that part continue to have your foot device fully configured with google services and more or leave now and get a reminder we're pretty much set up actually so we can leave and get a reminder and i'm pretty sure there are more steps that we need to take because that's always the case i would be surprised if there are no other steps or settings that we need to make Stay in, join millions of Motorola fans who receive exclusive information about product launches, events, tips, software updates, and much more. No, not now. Now. No, not now. Don't sign me up. Then we can choose our navigation styles. So we have the buttons here with the gestures. That always reminds me a bit of the iPhone navigation kind of style. I'm gonna go with the button navigation style and say next, maybe lighter. And, and now we're on our home screen. That wasn't too long, not too bad. Um, so that is the first setup of the Motorola Edge 40. Hope you liked it, hope it helped, and I hope to see you next time, bye.